This is episode 1658. Welcome to the Daily Meditation Podcast. I'm Mary Meckley, and I honor you for giving yourself permission to slow down and connect to the best part of who you are. Have you been able to do that much this busy, often hectic season? It's time of the year as we get ready to celebrate many holidays and end of the year parties and festivities. I hope you are allowing yourself to slow down your pace. And here you are getting ready to do just that. You showed up for yourself today. I honor you for that. And In today's episode, you are going to be guided to tap into your intuition for joy. This week, you have a special challenge, and the challenge is to schedule joy for yourself, just as you're scheduling a many number of things this time of the year. I challenge you to schedule joy for yourself. Schedule times where you allow yourself to tap into a deep sense of joy, not something fleeting such as happiness. That's the main difference between joy and happiness. Happiness is more fleeting, whereas joy is your true sense of peace that's always within you. And when you allow yourself moments of stillness, you begin to feel this joy rise up within you. And you know what's good for you intuitively. We know we should be doing this or we shouldn't be doing that. We know We don't always follow what is the best path, but it's there. Your inner wisdom is there. And so as you go about your days scheduling moments of peace, there are a few times of the day when you're most receptive to cues in your environment. And that is pretty universal. It's in the morning when you first wake up, that morning quiet before the rest of the world, although maybe up, people are not quite moving around, engaging their attention, their focus, their energy. So this is the ideal time to start your day with joy. Just sit for a moment, maybe as you have your coffee or tea or as you commute and close your eyes and think about what you may need in this particular moment and then feed your need. When you have the awareness of what you want, especially if you practice it on an ongoing basis, you become better and better at meeting your own needs. And this provides a sense of deep joy. Another time of day when you're receptive to your inner joy is in the afternoon. This is also a time when people pause. It's the middle of the day, high noon. Many people are having lunch. And so they're taking a little break. 
and this is a time for you to sit and reflect on the joy you need in this moment. And then finally, another great time to tap into your intuition is in the evening when the world has grown quiet. As you settle yourself down for the night, notice what you're grateful for. Go back and review your day and think about the times of the day that were significant times of joy. Go ahead now and settle yourself down as you get ready to experience your own inner stillness. As always, we have our full guided meditations on our Sip and Om meditation app, which you can try for two weeks, absolutely free. Access to the app of over 1,600 guided meditations. You can meditate up to half an hour with a brand new fully guided meditation every day with a journal and a guide for each week's series. Again, it's the Sip and Om meditation app. Anytime you feel open to your intuition is truly the right time to sit in stillness. The times I shared with you morning, afternoon, and evening are times when the world around you is quiet. For the most part, it's quiet during these times. As you begin to relax your mind and body with a straight spine, your eyes are closed and gently uplifted to the point between your eyebrows or your spiritual eye. This keeps your thoughts uplifted as you meditate. Notice your intuition. Listen to yourself. What is trying to emerge? Sit in stillness and allow yourself to open up to the ordinary moments you experience in life. Sometimes your ordinary moments Harbor the gold in your life. You are so worth slowing down for. Mm -hmm. 